What's up, CL fam? Tonight we're staying here. A little house in Essex with a scary past. This place is full of history, but there's one room in particular that we're interested in. This bedroom was originally decorated for the Macpherson's first child. The room was always eerie, but it wasn't until the boy's death that the first true hauntings began. Due to this, the superstitious couple locked the room, sealed it with holy symbols, and vowed to never step foot in there again. So we have arrived. Wow, that's like a proper show that was, like you come from behind the curtain. <laughs> it gets better, you need to go back. So, I think first things first, we should see where we're sleeping. <laughs> yeah. I thought this was going to be so panoramic, but watching Connor score. What's that? What's that? No, thank you. Close that back up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is the room that this we're staying in. the haunted... The haunted bedroom. <laughs> the only light we've got in here, we've been told, so uh... <laughs> it's great! So in addition to the story that we told at the start, when the little boy passed, the mother was apparently so distraught that she actually passed in the same room as him. So she didn't want to be alive anymore because her little boy was dead, so she came past as well. And that's when the door was locked forever yeah. until they dipped. And this room gives me boogie vibes, I don't like it. And this is where we're sleeping. What's this? A stick. Stick. Spooky. Yeah, I don't know how I feel if it's being sat on a bed that's got that up there if I'm not like a fully Christian or something like I know I'd be damned or something. What do you say, babe? Where are you gonna go toilet in the middle of the night? Don't worry. Hold on, let me demonstrate. Just pretend I'm asleep for a second. Oh, what's that? Oh, I need a wee. Okay, hold on. What's this? Is it a throne? That's what you have to ask. Is that a throne? Oh, is it a throne? Is it a throne, babe? It looks like a throne, doesn't it? Very it does indeed. Vibes. It looks very oh, like. Well, well, you would be mistaken because uh, it's actually a shit. People have had their bare bums on there and you're just sat there in your trousers. So we know there was a little boy that passed here and we were speaking to one of the owners as well and he said that some people have come here and they can't even walk into this room. Like they just stand by the door and they're just like, nope, I can't be. What? There's a picture of the little boy. Really? Yeah. Oh yeah. And this is probably like school uniform or something? I think before we do anything, like this place is amazing. We need to show you the different rooms because they're just so weird and amazing. This is like a detective's room. A detective's office. A detective's office is what I said. It's not what she said. Wow, what are you looking for? Your willy. Baptism, <laughs> put that down. Detective Brooker at your service. I mean, this place is so cool down to every detail and the smell in here is so great. Actually, I think there was something about like the detective in here. Detective of demons and all sorts demons of things. Demons or something, yeah. Do you know what I hate the most? Creepy pictures. What is that? What is, what is this? What is that? Hello. Okay. Oh, it's a bit chill, isn't it? The hidden gems in this place are unbelievable. I don't. F I feel like I'm somewhere else. And here's the main living quarters. It's crazy. I'm sorry. There's only one thing I have to say. What? That horse got wonder. I mean, let me take you over here. Who knew that they'd make a stone carving of my stepdad, Carl? Unbelievable. That's a compliment. They even got his goatee. I keep hearing really weird noises in this room. Coming from the wardrobe yeah, side. from behind the wardrobe. What is that? Okay, so I think we're going to go for some food so we can, like, discuss this a bit louder and talk about the vibe that we're getting from this place so far. And then we'll come back and do some tests. I'm always open to sit in and have food. So we're in the car eating pizza and kebab. But well, I didn't get mayonnaise. They didn't give a mayonnaise. Anyways, so there is some rooms that we haven't been into. I'm honestly really scared. I'm scared, but also, like you've seen in our previous haunted videos, like we've had a couple of knocks and bangs, but I want to see something. I want to see something tonight. I see that. I say this every single time though. We always have a rational excuse to put behind anything that happens. Mm. I want something to happen that we can't explain. Yeah. And I feel like this place might be it because it's just, I don't know, I get a weird vibe. I want to see a woman walk in front of me followed by a boy 
Yeah, that's what I want to see. I think the worst thing we've had is the, the knock on the door from Pearl. Pearl, can you hear me? Hello? And then the the black shadow, which we didn't get on camera, but again, could have been a bat. But Did you get some tissues of that? Because your fingers are greasy no, as hell. Other than that, the guy that is is there with us is so oh, he's cool. amazing. This guy dresses like an absolute G. He's a nice guy. Been telling us all the history and the stories, and also he's made us feel a bit better because he's told us that nothing's going to jump out from the wardrobes a couple of times. Yeah, but I feel like he said that in a suspicious way. Yeah, something jumped out the wardrobe before. So but, you know what? We're going to carry on and see what we find and, and try and get some sleep if we possibly I'm can. Eat so I've just turned this on and it's going absolutely crazy. I've never seen it do anything like that before. Look at it. He's literally going all the way up to red. I think we should place some equipment around the room and try and get a better vibe. I'm gonna place this near where I guess he would have played. I scared the hell out of me and was my own hand. This room just gives off such booky vibes. I can hear like a constant moaning. I can't believe we've got to sleep on this bed. That's Good actually dip. that's actually petrifying. You don't hear that. There's also a covered up picture here of Boys in the middle. What was that? <sighs> what was that? I can't see. That's just so booky. Oh my god, it sounds like a fire, doesn't it? Like a fireplace going mad. Yeah, well, there is a fireplace, but there's no fire. There's no fire. No. But the fact that fire noises are coming from there is crazy. I'm just kind of waiting for something to happen or spike. Mm. What? Oh my god, is that a Ouija board? Yeah. You've just found that. Where was it? Down the side. Is there a planchette? No. There's not a planchette? No, it's not a little wooden sword though. No, I've never seen one like this Is that this an old before. fashioned one? I've never seen one before like this. Made in the USA. I'm gonna put that back before I, you know, get demonated by something. What's even in this? Oh my god, there's a wooden knife down there. <gasps> no way. Oh my god. No way. Oh my god, what? you just found <gasps> Jets in the in the wardrobe in the oh, cupboard. Like what are the odds that I just found that? That's so booky. I wasn't even gonna open that. He's hidden away in a cupboard. There's his stuffed animals. What was that? I don't know. I just heard a voice. I just heard talking. By the way, guys, we're literally the only people here apart from one of the people that runs the place. But he's outside. He's, he's staying he's got in the his cabin. Own place. But we are literally the only people in this building, so if any noises are heard, it's not people. I just don't understand why that would be in the cupboard. Locked away? I don't dare touch it. That makes no sense. It's been used quite a few times by the looks of it. Yeah, it's born. I'm so sorry. You've, you've trumped. Yeah, but sorry. I mean, you can't it, trump I've, got, it I've got a scaredy belly. I wondered what the smell was. I was thinking, is that a <laughs> demon? Like, no, no, it's your ass. So I've decided we're going to do the Ouija board because I feel like the fact that I found the planchet is coincidence. So we should we should definitely do it because we've never done one before. We only ever did it once in our house and that's it. We, this is a proper one though. Like I've never seen one like this before. I don't like messing with stuff like this. But I think we have to whilst we're here. The fact that I found that. What was that? Oh my god, the, the thing's going crazy, babe. You sure you want to do this? No. We would like to make contact with any spirits that might be in this room. We only welcome good spirits to make contact with us. Come and talk to us. Is the little boy that died in this room here? Oh my god. Babe. Oh my god. Oh, I can't take my hand off, can I? No. We're trying to make contact with the little boy who passed in this room. Are you here with us? Come and talk to us. If you are here with us, can you move the planchette to yes? I'm not moving that, I promise. I'm literally bouncing my fingers. Are you? You're doing it. No, I swear to God. So that's moving to are yes by itself? No, nah, you're joking. Please tell me you're joking. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Did you move that? Um... 
Promise me. Uh, that was not me. Promise. I promise that was not me. Can you ask another question? I don't know what to ask because I'm scared now. What do you mean you're scared? Because I didn't expect it to move. Do you want to just say goodbye then? No. I feel a weird energy around me now, I'm not yeah. even joking. I don't know if that's okay. because it just moved and I'm feeling booked out, but... I keep, like, hearing... What the f***? What, 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 what? Are we... I was looking at the painting and it looked like it was moving. Shut up. Over there in the corner. Don't, because you're scaring me now. It looked I don't like it was moving. Because it's behind me. Was that you? Did you move the painting on the wall? Did you just move it? Do you like us being here? Goodbye. 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 I'm gonna put this back where I found it because it scared me. Okay, so we've decided that we're gonna go to sleep. And I'm gonna try to go to sleep. We're gonna try to go to sleep. And we're gonna set an alarm for... Reaching hour. 3 a.m. Um, hopefully we wake up. We probably will. With the I don't think we'll sleep. Never mind wake up. Probably not, but we're gonna try anyway. Um, so we'll see you at 3. Have pity on me. Don't do stuff like that. Scared me a little bit. Oh no, it's a demon. <laughs> I want to be on this side because I'm close to the door if we need to run. Actually, is this really how comfortable. Is this... The boy in this room had a very nice bed. Oh, thank you for letting us use it. No. Have you? No. Yeah, I can, your breath is kiffy. It's not my breath. What was that smell then? What was that? What, what was that? I knew I saw something before we went to bed. What was that? What was that then? Get off, get off me. What the hell was that? I can't even see properly. Oh, God. So I've literally just woken up and something's just flew above our head. Something white is just flew across Something away. white just flew across the ceiling. Now that's booky. Well, anyway, we need to be quick. It's witching hours, so we should do the call outs before it gets too early. I think my feet smell. I think I can smell my feet. I'm going to put my shoes back on. One thing I will say is I know it's 3 a.m., but it's gone from like roasting in here when we went to sleep to like absolutely freezing. So we've decided that we're going to use this voice recorder. If you don't know what it is, we basically talk to the spirits and because they're so quiet, this basically picks up anything, like you breathing. It hears everything. We're calling out to any spirits in this room. We'd like to make contact with you. Come and talk to us. Is the little boy that passed here in this room with us now? Is your mother here? Can you come and make contact with us? Come and tell us what you want to say. If you speak into this little black machine in front of me, it will hear you. Did you die here? Was this your room? Do you wish us any harm? How long have you been here? Are you angry that we're in your bedroom? Or are you someone else? So there was nothing on there. Which is so strange because I could have swore I heard like a woman's voice when you asked if anyone else was here. Coming from that way. But it's strange that we'd hear it and that wouldn't pick it up because that I know, picks, it picks up, up the most quietest sounds. Uh, wow, that was a good burp. What are you doing? Hmm? Why are you up there? Because I want to know what the white thing was. Well, we, it was a glimpse of something. It was probably a moth or something. It was weird, but it was probably a moth. <laughs> 
Bubby? Bubby, what the hell are you doing? Bubby? <laughs> so good. Why would you joke with me like, I don't care what's under the bed, why would you joke with me like? Look what we've just found under the bed. I'm so glad I fainted now. Oh yeah, is that right? We found the boy's school book. What does that even say? Lethan? Morphison? It's just his name. <laughs> Wait, what? Someone's drowning. Drew that. Not a chance. Is that like a demon or something? I don't know, but that's really creepy. Um, that is a beheading. Can we actually show this? I don't know. That's a little bit graphical. Yeah. Are they alien? I'm so confused to what's going on. Could be him and his mum and dad. Keep going, keep going. There's a chest with a key. I don't get it. It's a Ouija board. Is that what that is? There's a Ouija board on paper. That's his, that, that is his Ouija board. Okay, the one that we just used. How is this a school book? It definitely wasn't used as a school book, was it? Oh my god, there's so many. What the hell is that? Is that it? That's it. Okay, that's creepy. I'm kind of glad, but also like really scared at the fact that we found that and I think we should leave. That's <laughs> actually terrified me. That, that was terrified. It reminds you of the films, doesn't it? That's spooky.